Hello friends, welcome to KK Java Tutorials. In this video tutorial, we'll talk about uh, one of the SQL developer uh, uh, tool feature that is called show query results in new tab here. Yeah. And that we can achieve through a pin. So here you can see one pin, right? So if I run any query, right? If I, let's say I'm running this query, select query, then you can see the result at the bottom. If I run another query, right? Then a result is going to display in the same uh, query result tab right but sometimes let's say if you want to display a uh, query results in different tab then this pin feature comes into the picture right so here what you can do this pin just you will have to click over here or you can put cursor here and press ctrl i then you can see this pin becomes vertical right if you want to unpin it then again you will have to click so let's say i'm pinning my result pinning my result means uh, this uh, query results will be preserved and if you run another query then that will be displayed in the some uh, other tab right let me run this query then now here you can see there is one more query result tab got open because previous one was pinned now if you want to pin it this one as well then click over here this will get pinned as well and if you run another query then the result of uh, this query uh, will be displayed in another tab so here you can see now third tab got open so if you are running multiple query and if you want to do kind of a, a basically comparison if you want to preserve a output of a previous query then you can uh, take advantage of this feature right and uh, let's say if you want to uh, again set as a default behavior, behavior as earlier it was working then close all the tabs and this tab again you can unpin and if i run this query then query result will be again uh, going to display in the same same tab right so i hope you understood this feature this feature is really really uh very beneficial for a developer guys so that's all i have in this video tutorial i hope you enjoy learning this video guys big thank you and see you there in the next video tutorial